I dream a lot about epic disasters. It sounds cliche, but it started after 9-11. One dream like this starts with me in midtown Manhattan. We notice a large warplane flying above us. By the time we all notice it, it starts firebombing us. The bombs fall and fall. I remember how the bombs looked falling through the skyscrapers as vividly as if it happened to me in my waking life. The bombs fall and fall and we run and run, trying to get somewhere safe, but nowhere is safe. There's lots of horror and lots of trying to help anyone and myself survive. But the planes and the bombs keep coming and coming. Every time I have these dreams, I mentally hit a point of no return. My hope dissipates into the realization that I'm not likely to survive. That most of us won't. I realize that I have no idea where my family is, where my friends are, where my lover is. I realize that they easily could all be dead. I realize that it's incredibly likely that I will never see any of them ever again. If I survive. Then I have the final thought of my disaster dreams, which is, it's all over. Meaning, life as I knew it, as we knew it. The despair I feel in this moment of the dream is profound. But the despair is accompanied by a deep feeling of release, total emptiness, a kind of freedom. It's all over. And that's okay that it's all over, because that's what's happening. This time, this moment, this existence is over. It's our turn to die. Time for the next thing. It's a big universe out there. Then I wake up.